Hello guys and welcome to this video. This is the final video of this course and we will talk about exporting the project. I will show you how to save the project in a type that you can edit it later if you want. And the second way is we export the project as a video and we have two ways to do that. We can export the video using the Adobe Premiere software or the media encoder. Using the open project button earlier, now we can save the project whenever we make a change to it. So we click save. We go to file and we click save to save the, change, the, the changes we just did. And of course we can find the project in the location we set earlier in the open project option. And for me it's right here in the desktop. So we save the project and if we want to come back to it and change it, all we do is we locate the project file and we open it. So this is how we export the project in a way that enables us to change it later. Now we move to exporting the project as a video that you can upload on any place you want. You can either export the full video or just a part of it. Now if we export the file right now it will be the whole video. But if I want to export only a part of the video, for example this part right here, I set the cursor on the beginning of the part of the video that I want to export, then right click and I select mark in. Now I put the cursor on the end of the part I want to export. So this is the duration of the video I want to export. It's about 5 seconds. Now right click and I select mark out. So as you can see the part of the video is marked. Now to export this part of the video I go to file then I go to export then I select media shortcut control plus M. Then we get this window and this is the video we will export. From here you can set the video format. We have so many formats in here. For me I will select this format. Now after setting the format, we click on export. We wait a little bit. And here we are. I will go to the location. I set the desktop. And here it is. We exported only the part we marked instead of the full video. And this is the file informations. We have the size and the format and everything. Now we talked about the first way of exporting, so we move to the second one. So we go to File, Export, Media, and after we set the format, we don't use Export. Instead of Export, I select Q. So I click on Q. In this way, we use the Media Encoder instead of the Adobe Premiere software to export the file. We wait a little bit and here we are. This is our file. We can change its format from here. And this is the file location. For me, I set the desktop as the location. Now we click here to export the video. We wait a little bit. I have here two videos, so that's why we wait a little bit longer. And here we are. So this is the video we exported.
So this is how we export part of videos in the Adobe Premiere software and the media encoder. And of course I can edit the exported video duration by dragging the marked space like this. And if I want to export the full video and not just part of it, all I have to do is to remove the marker like this. Right click and clear in and out. And the marker is gone. So then again I go to file export media and I set the file format. Then I choose either to export the file with the Adobe Premiere or the media encoder. I can either click export or queue and I click export if I want to export the file using the Adobe Premiere software. I will give the file a name, for example new video, then as I said I will click on export to export the file using the Adobe Premiere software. This will take a little bit longer because this video is longer than the other one. We have exported only a part of the video earlier, but now we are exporting the full video. So it will take a little bit longer. And here we are, this is the video. As you can see, we exported the full video. So that's it for this video, and it's the last video of this course. I hope that it was useful to you and you liked what you saw in this course. Thanks very much for watching, and I hope to see you in another one of my courses.